Hey guys, it's Aaron at Ironworks. Uh, we get asked a lot of the time when and how people should bleed their radiators. So I'm just gonna give you a quick demonstration here. Generally, I wouldn't bleed my rads unless I felt that they were cold halfway up while the heating system was running. If you've got a bottom of a rad that's warm and a top that's cold, there's a good chance it's got air. I've got a bleeder in this rad and I've hooked it up for, to water for you. I like to just use a little handful of paper towel to catch the water when it comes out. You can use a cup if you've got enough room there between the rad and the wall. What you're gonna do is open the bleeder, letting the air out, and you're just gonna continue to do that until you get water. Keep the paper towel under there so that it catches the water as it sprays around. And our rad is bled. Clean up any drips on the rad, and you're all done. The one thing I will always caution you is never take the handle out of the bleeder completely and I will show you why. The red water comes and it surprises you and it's not in there. It's going to shoot that right out of your hand and make a bit of a flood in your house. 